the key is that learning has to be active and engaged. So unless it's something that people are really engaged in and they are actively involved in doing, it's unlikely that they're going to get very far. Um, it follows from that that learning has to be motivating. Uh, and that is a mixture of intrinsic mainly, but sometimes extrinsic motivation. And um, it's also um, vital to attend to the social and emotional aspects of cognition, not just the analytical um, and, uh, and factual sides. So learning that motivates is increasingly personalised in that sense. It's personalised in the sense that it's responding to people's need, but it's personalised in a deeper sense, which is persuading people to see that learning is a personal project that they want to invest in. The point of personalization is not consumerization, it's to turn people into investors. How do you get people to see themselves as investors in learning? Um, and that as a result it, it becomes, over time, self-regulating, non-standardized, and has this mix, as I said, of intrinsic and extrinsic.